Tschü. Race, can you put more in the subs? I make them a little bit more round. Yeah. Mahalo.
blues right now.
We'll make all the greetings now. Thank you for joining us today for Hano Hano Kuhio. Aloha to Uncle Led Ka'apana. Thank you for being here today and at the Sharon and the Ohana. We'd like to say aloha to all our family from Tihatis, Malo Lava, PCDC. Joining us here today, PCDC and Keehi Lagoon. All our sponsors for this event, Manuai, Aloha Mai. Manuai, how are you, brother? Manuai. Murky. Murky. How are you? Aloha, Manuai. Good to see you. we like to thank everybody um, for coming today. Oh, and oh, we cannot forget the Makaha. The Makaha Tito. We are here. Oi, Tito. Thank you for joining us today. Okay, so we're here to celebrate Kuhio and Telinda Aloha. Um, Prince Kuhio, for those of you that don't know, if you're, if you're not from the homestead, guarantee you get Ohana on the homestead. Yeah, so f- one of the first homesteads here in Oahu was Papakolea, which a lot of us do come from. But we like to say aloha to all our Ohana from Waimanalo to Nanakuli to Kapolei to Papakolea. Where else? Waimanalo. Uh, where? Oh, yeah, that's Molokai, Mary. Wait, wait, Mary, I don't know Oahu yet. <laughs> yeah, Waimanalo, where else? Haula homestead, there you go. Anybody? This is an audience participation, so come on. Can anybody tell me any other homestead on this island? Okay, we said Waimanalo 10 times already. Okay, all right. Why in Nanakuli? What about Maili? We got Maili homestead. Huh? <laughs> oh, Princess Kahanu homestead, there you go. And the first Hawaiian homestead is where? What? No. What? Ho'olehua is the first Hawaiian homestead. The second one is Kalamaula. The third is Papakulea. Fourth is Nanakuli. But you know, that may be up for discussion over there in Facebook land, the Rippers. <laughs> but yeah, no worry, I get the pala pala. <laughs> my cousin Kiao on bass, my cousin Sean on guitar. We're going to cut in some music for you guys, so keep back, relax. Show them the area on the side. Hello, friends. 
Facebook and Instagram out there.
a Royal Hawaiian Hotel Koi Loa Hano Hano Yela Hela Nila Ke Hula Nile Ya Hela Nima Oli No Eo Eka Royal Hawaiian Hotel Koi Loa Hano Hano Yela Hela Nila Ke Hula Nile Mahalo, mahalo to everybody. <laughs> okay, folks. Um, once again, mahalo for joining us here to celebrate um, Prince Kuhio, Kalani Ole, the Hawaiian Homes Commission Act of... 1921, we celebrated here a couple of years back. I think it was two years ago. We made the 100th anniversary of the Hawaiian Homes Commission Act. And we are very thankful. And well, no, yeah, it was a time during COVID. So we did a live stream during that time too. And we're doing it again. So we'd like to say mahalo to um, OEV TV and Brother Bryson. Mahalo Nui Bryson, our sound engineer um, with Kings, um, Kingsley's sound equipment there. Mahalo Nui, brother. Mahalo, mahalo, mahalo. So kick back there. We've got a lot of entertainment for you. We're going to cut in a little bit more songs and get some poopoos ready for everybody. And uh, are we live yet, um, brother? So, okay, so who's on? Any, any requests from Facebook land? No, Tell thank it. you. No. Yeah, it's $100 per request for good cause. Right. We like to say mahalo to Mahina Paishan as well. This is her place, the Kavai Bai Collective. Um, it's a space where I'm opening up to a lot of Native Hawaiian businesses here. And outside, to my right, your left, we got some Native Hawaiian vendors out there too. Leira, Leira Organics. What else we got? Molokai. Oh. Did the Ina need give us that view? We do it with love. But see, she know she's style. You see, she no fool around. She tell one song, boom, hundred dollars. Put one of our applause for Moloka Inuyahina and Hano Hano Maka. That's how to do it, lovely.
song we got a lot of entertainment for you guys once again give yourselves a hand for being here and um, for purchasing those tickets which is helping native hawaiian youth part of the thing that prince kuhio wanted to do was to um, rehabilitate our people yeah for those of you that uh, may not know but if you don't know now you can go online and go read yeah you know no more just library yeah when you have to catch bus to the library or to the school, you can go online in Mahaoi. But don't re- don't believe everything you read, okay? <laughs> Let's call me, check it with me. Nana. Okay. Once again, um, Cousin Kiao Costa on bass. And also... Okay, you can chop me off from here. <laughs> and Cousin Sean on guitar. But we also, we also want to let you know that we have um, a lot of raffles. Go check out Tita um, Trinity. A sing over there. She'll be taking care of all the, the rappers. We got a lot of stuff that was donated by Mana Ola Hawaii as well, which is Ohana to me. We have the Lim family. We have Uncle Letter coming up very shortly, folks. So once again, thank you for joining us today. Um, we still got tickets, but now we don't. We sold out already. Ah! Okay, we're going to dedicate this. We're going to dedicate this to all the hula dancers. So if it moves you, just hula where you at, okay? Oh, there you go. And here's my hula brother, everybody. I'm so glad he's here. This is Chinky Mahoy and Kabaili Hula. Him and his wife. Cool, huh, brother? Thank you. 
Check, check. Okay, folks, at this time we'd like to um, introduce uh, Ohana to me over here. This is Uncle Leonard Kalapana of um, Kalapana, of Kalapana area in Hawaii Island, Mokuokeave. He's a legend, Saki guitar artist, been around the world. And uh, we're so happy to have him. I called Auntie Sharon and said, Auntie Sharon, I'm not available. And then she said, okay, baby, wait, let me check. <laughs> hey, then I also went to check yeah. um, if the Ohana Serenitas could come, which is his sister. His sisters, um, that um, many people don't know, they are the Ka'apana sisters, yeah? And um, unfortunately, Auntie's um, a little bit ma'i, but we're going to pull it for her. Keep her in your guys' prayers. And her pull, I'm um, in pule. For Auntie, she's not feeling well, but we're going to keep her in our pool. Is Auntie Rhoda Kapana and Auntie Lei and all those wonderful titas, Tichubi them and other Ohana. But I'm so honored to introduce, ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the legendary, the one and only, a third of the Hui Ohana, Mr. Letter Kapana. Aloha.
Mahalo. Mahalo, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, folks. It's, it's an honor to be here today. I want a nice hand for my bass player. This is Jesse Gregor Siga. Hello. Yeah. Mahalo. Mahalo, Jesse. They never had enough lay for Jesse, so, you know, my, I, you, you know a little bit too big, so only, only one day enough for, for us to. <laughs> so, far, how's everybody doing? Good? You guys all right? And what a busy day today for me, so... 
Anyway, I come from the big island of Hawaii from a place called Kalapana where I learned all this music called Kiyo Alu. For Hawaiian Slaki for my Ohana. As I was growing up, you know, my family played music and I was so fortunate and so blessed to learn music at home by just watching them perform and Kani Kapila and remembering all the tunings and, you know, the music. And, and my turn to come out and share what, you know, I learned from them. So. This one of the songs that I, my uncle used to play, like two o'clock in the morning, you know, living in Kalapana, no electricity. Uh, you know, everything is cuckoo, hilipo, lantern, and uh, two o'clock in the morning, he's playing this song called Radio Hula and My Yellow Gingery.
This next song was uh, composed for uh, good friends of ours from the Aikau family. Uh, Solomon Aikau used to play with my twin brother, the late uh, Nidward, Nikki Boy Kaapana. So he composed a song called Kolomona, which translated as uh, Solomon.
I'd also like to say good, good uh, mahalo and, and aloha to a good friend. I haven't seen this guy since back in the 70s. Uh, Chiki Mahoi. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kupuna already. Yeah, me a kupuna already. Yeah, so. But, but nice seeing you, man. Yeah, yeah, he was a young boy. <laughs> you can call me grandpa now. <laughs> That was a good day, yeah. That was a good day, yeah. yeah. Had a lot of music all over Waikiki, but I remember you can park your car one place and walk all over. Music all over, yeah.
Thank you. Yes, I remember back in the days, this was my first instrument I learned before going to guitar. A uh, song is to play called Chicken in the Straw or Glass Ball Slacky.
<laughs> Glass walls like here. <laughs> this is a song that I, I recorded. Uh, also, I heard this song on the radio. It's called Love is Blue. Goes like this. The song is called Love is Blue. Mahalo, mahalo. Another song that I recorded do for you, the song called Killing Me Slowly. I mean, Killing Me Softly.
Healing me slowly. Mahalo, mahalo. I didn't check the time. I didn't check the time. 45 minutes. It's, it's 1.38 right now. 15 minutes. It's now 1.45, huh? Yeah. So 10 get, more. So I get like 5, 6 more minutes. Oh. Oh. You just wait. Maybe one or two more. Two more. One. Up. Yeah. One of my favorite songs uh, <clears throat> that takes you to the beautiful island of Kauai. Special place called Kuki.
Once again, about nice stand for Jesse Gregory over here. We say mahalo to Puka and the rest of the gang for having us here. Don't forget, we got plenty more music coming up. So we can share our last song with all of you folks again. God bless everybody. Have a wonderful afternoon. Once again, how's about a round of applause for Uncle Letter Kapana, everybody? Show me your love. How's the may I? Is the may I okay? Okay, mahalo. So if you notice the luau, I'm going to give you a little bit story. 
So the luau, you, you, you see a little bit, um, what is that word? Activity in the luau. So Samoan style, yeah? Because my cousin, we're part Samoan too, yeah? So instead of we cut the haha small, he cut the haha big. So take a little bit while for cook them down. But is it or no? Okay, main thing. Mahalo nui. Okay, once again, mahalo um, all of our sponsors, uh, Kehi Lagoon, I'm, Ke- I'm Dan, Kiko Olani, and uh, Ohana over there. Thank you guys for coming and all the support. Um, Tihati Productions, my family, the Thompson Ohana. We're so happy um, for them um, to have joined us this evening too, and also one of our title sponsors. And the PCDC, Papakole um, Community Development Corporation. They're feeding hard right now. They continue to feed. Okay, and so we got some raffle prizes. We're going to call some raffles at this time. And here's my, my Ohana all the way from Kohala, the Lim family. Put your hands together for the Lim Ohana. They're going to be setting up very shortly. Hui. Okay. Okay. So we're going to call this raffle. Everybody got their... It's, Everybody got their raffle tickets ready? Okay. Let me dig into this full glass of raffles. Okay, that was funny. Okay, this is from um, Auntie Nani's son. So for those of you that don't know, Nani, Auntie Nani Lim, her son is Mana Ola, and she's part of the Lim family. She's a third of the Lim Ohana. Okay, so here's the number, 54701-EHA. Lima fa fiku zero kasi fa. Lima fa fiku zero kasi fa. Lima e ha e hiku ole kahi ha. We got no winner. We, we for real. We no more no winner. Okay. Yes. <laughs> She'll take it. Hey, they're not here, honey. They lose. Yeah, give your name. Give your name. Okay. Well, if they're not here, they lose out. That's how the raffle goes, right? Right? Nikki. Who's Nikki? Who's Nikki? I thought she said me. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> two nine two five five two two. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is Mele Apana. Everybody, she just bought raffles and she won. You see him? You give her, give her it, give it to her. A hard honey, mana ola lani. <laughs> Round of applause for Mele Apana, everybody. Okay, we got one more. No. Okay, that's all we got for now. So keep buying more raffles. Mahalo Nui as we set up. Okay, we're going to go around the table. We're going to maho some of these um, homesteaders. I know Ho'opula Pula. Okay, what Ho'opula Pula are you from, my dear? Tell everybody who you are. Aloha, Luan Mahiki Langford Fabarito. Oh, one of applause for Ho'olehua Aina Ho Pula Pula. The first Aina Ho Pula Pula. Thank you, love. Okay, and, and we have another here. Aina Ho Pula Pula. And um, what homestead are you from, my dear? What homestead are you from? Round of applause for P-A-P-A-K-O-L-E-A, Papa Kole Hawaiian Homestead. So, um, for those of you that are familiar with the um, Kamana Beach Hotel, her son is the general manager there, High Hills Zablan. Brother, check out the Kamana Beach Hotel. It's, a, it's the number one boutique hotel in Oahu, and Waikiki. Okay, and who else we got? We got anybody from Waianae Homestead? Waianae? Any from Waianae? No, Nana Kuli, are you from Waianae Homestead? 
But why am I? You know, you should have said, yeah, nobody would know. <laughs> okay, I ran away. What about Nana Kuli? Huh? Anybody from Nana Kuli? Oh, Kaleo. Oh, Kamanu. Are you from there? Okay, what's your name? Come, brother. Okay, what, what the Ohana from? From the Poshai, Paishan Ohana. And what's your name? They know me as Bodhi. Ma Bodhi. <laughs> this is the owner um, of YY Collective. This is um, Uncle Bodhi Paishan. That's Mahina's father. Mahalo Nui. Yeah, put your hands together. That's why we're here today. We're able to um, be here. Mahalo again, Uncle Led. Um, you know, for those of you that remember um, the Hui Ohana, um, which consisted of Uncle Ned Kaapana, Uncle Led's twin, and their um, first cousin, Dennis Pavao, which created the Ohana in the 70s. Yeah, If you remember Hui Ohana, put your hands together and give them some aloha and love. Uncle Led is the only one living from the Hui Ohana, so we got a legend here. Okay, who else? What about anybody from um, any, I know, Pula Pula from Hawaii Island? I, I'm from Waimeo, um, Kui Homestead too, up in um, Kamuela, Hawaii. So I, I represent Kamuela and Papakolea. Anybody from there? Oh, Kao Kaha, cousin Kao Kaha, okay. Okay, two cousin Kaia, Oliva Lansardia, my, my Papakolea no, and Tona Ohana, my, uh, my Kao Kaha, eh? Okay. Aloha, um, no keo kahaku ohana o kalis, and um, o kalis kainoa hope o kuu kupu na kane, a ka uahana ia, hana ia oya e ka ohana kalis, mamua o kela o kaili kai kona inoa hope, kaili no kohala, a ka noho oya ma keo kaha. Uh, mahalo, mahalo, cousin. That was our cousin. You guys, uh, did anybody hear, hear um, Hiva? No. Hello? Hello? Oh, mercy. Hano, hai o lelo ke ia. Tu cousin. Kala mai aloha. Ovao o kahiva hiva. No keo kaha mai kuu makua kane. O Kahoali i Kalis, a kamamua o kela u hanai ia oya e ka ohana Kalis, a ka o kaili kona inoa pono i. A no keo kaha mai oya, a no papokolea mai ku makua hine. Mahalo. A o ka ohana umi aliloa a me kalakaua mako o ka ohana namahoe. Mahalo. And we just love Prince Kuhio for all of our land that we still have today. Just even if it's so little bit in all of the Pai Aina, um, we're still grateful that we still have a little bit. But, you know, we could have a little bit more for everybody. But we're so lucky. I'm so lucky to be a part of that ohana from Papa Kolea. And, of course, I'm sure everybody is. <laughs> Puka, where are you? <laughs> I'm Hello. <laughs> I think this belongs to you, Auntie. To, Puka had to get the bass. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, since she's in the back, who else wants to talk about where they're from? <laughs> I know my cousin over here. She's from Papakolea. This is <laughs> this is um, Auntie Genoa's granddaughter over here from Papa Kolea. Yes, hi, man. <laughs> Aloha, Francine. <laughs> Kahiva Hiva Kalamai. Aloha, Papa Kolea Ohana. Um, so, are we? Is this Ho'olauna? Ha'iolelo. Okay. Well, I'm happy to be here because. Um, 
I was born and raised on Aina Ho'opulupula, Papakolea. And um, yeah, I've been there my whole life. And, you know, I can attribute everything of what I've learned and who I've become to this this place. And, and one of the... One of the main reasons for Kuhio doing this, uh, giving the land back to our people, is so that we would have a place to be able to cultivate our culture and to grow our mo'olelo, to teach our children, teach the next generation how to malama, not just the aina, but in having our own place to be able to have space to, to be us. And so... We're grateful to um, Kuhio for allowing us that opportunity, and and this day we we so so fitting. Yeah, the name Mele Hano Hano Kuhio. Okay, and sitting right behind me is none other than Mr. Kamahao Haumea Thrones, <laughs> who I know can it can do a wonderful job at introducing the next group. Yes. How are we, everybody? Oh, it is so wonderful. I just came from Kamehameha. We had our new orientation for all the new Haumana coming. Um, so I got to Ho'olauna them and got to meet all of them and uh, Kanikapila Samele and celebrate our culture. And we're here again and we have one more event to go after this. But everybody... Oh, okay. Well. Okay, well then. You know, like Auntie Pumai said, you know, I have another wonderful person sitting behind me. Please welcome the one and only Mele Apana. You, you see how you guys are? I was like, oh, I'm going to go drink Ava. I'm going to go make Shishi and they're passing the mic to me. He was, I'm supposed to be off right now. Anyway, aloha everybody. My name is Barbara Nobrega. No, I'm just so happy to be here. I came to support uh, my brother Puka Singh and Papa Kolea and all of you folks. And we're only here for a little bit because I have to MC Halau uh, Namamo Puanahulu's Hula Lea, which starts in like two hours. So I'm just here to show my love and, uh, and aloha for all of you folks and all of her wonderful entertainment. And it is quite busy right now because uh, we're gearing up for the Mary Monarch Hula Competition. Who's going to Mary Monarch make some noise? Yes. Speaking about Mary Monarch next to me is one of my favorite Kumu Hula. I knew him since I was small. He's on break. Pass the mic. Actually, I'm still small. Just your eyes are big. Uh, he's taking a break from Mary Monarch this year, but I also emceed his Kavaili Ula uh, Hoike. Uh, not too long ago. So ladies and gentlemen, Chinky Moho is in the house, everybody. And uh, speaking about Mary Monarch, uh, we're getting ready. It starts in a week and a half. And it, I didn't announce it publicly, only at uh, all the hula events I've been emceeing. But I'm really, really honored this year. It's, it's a, actually a surprise. It was a surprise to me to get a phone call. Uh, but this year, um, I was asked to join and be the co MC with Uncle Kimo Kahoano. And so... The pressure yes. is on. The kuleana is huge. Oh, the camera. You had my okole the whole time. I forgot. But And the camera on that side. But anyway, I'm just really uh, humbly blessed and honored. Uh, in a life of hula and music, that's what we do. Hula, and life, hula is life. Music is life. And that is why we have all the best of the best and all the superstars of music here with us today. So ladies and gentlemen... Papa Kulea, Nana Kuli, why am I Honolulu, Kane Ohe, Kailua? I'm from Kauai. Let's give a warm welcome for this Ohana that came all the way from Kohala, Hawaii. They are the legendary Honolulu Makes a Noise with the Lim family. I'm 
We're so happy to be here with all of you. We welcome all of you this beautiful day as we celebrate our great Grand Ihu. Set aside Aina for us to malama ourselves, as was mentioned time and time again. And I've been honored as well to have my mother and carry on my mother's piece of land on Hawaii Island. So just like the rest of us, as we hoopula pula our roots and our kuleana to Malama, the land that was set aside for us by Ali Inui again. Celebrating all of you a very warm aloha no kako. This is very strange. Without shoes. <laughs> yeah. I but tap so in my nice. toes, I can see it. But so nice. Tell me what you was going to do. No height. It's fine. Yeah. She know, we like be tall and... So we were outside over here, just us. Nobody was there. <laughs> Open up our, our Very suitcases cool, and just change our clothes right outside there. <laughs> People passing right by, we said, they don't know us. We're not sure. We don't care. So Kohala, just have more good. We're fine. And then she goes... What if we wore these pink slippers that's in the bathroom on the stage? Can? I sure can. We almost did. <laughs> We've been comfortable. Oh, aloha. Oh, aloha. reminds us of why we do what we do because it is our love for our music for our ohana for our family for everything that we share because it is a gift it's a makana that we share from my puuvai always so mahalo for coming today aloha
From our home to all of you, from our home Kohala. Mahalo Anui Loa. Thank you so much. What a beautiful way to spend the day. And as um, our, I don't know if you want to say, um, again, let's give a great big hand to all of our people. Just introduce our group. We have Paul Maya along with our baby Kamahao. And of course, this year's Mary Monarch surprise. Let's give these three guys a round of applause for announcing our Ohana and bringing us on stage. Talent for sure is in the house. Only because they brought up Mary Monarch and it's time to, for Hila to come alive in the next couple of weeks. Trying to think what I'm going to buy. So, you know, I like shop around, but he's scared because I'm waiting for them. Okay? So, yeah, and then, and then no can afford for buy your gas for come home. Just joking. Anyway, so let's go with Hilo Hula. Some toe tapping, ili ili clacking, ipu snapping kind of songs. Here we go. Anytime you like, start, Sunny. I know, I can feel my toes doing this, so no look, okay, guys? Remember the days of Clark's Gallon being your ipu, okay? All right, you ready, Nani? No. <laughs> you like on your toes or something? No? <laughs> kind of feels nice. Yeah, feels nice. Very kanaka. You feel like very down, grounded. Grounded is the word. All right. Yeah, get everybody. Get plenty hula dancers today. And cheap, if you you're see, not looking your face. <laughs> if you see a girl, girl in a red holoku, it's not Pele. It's the kind. Um, <laughs> oh, the girl in the yellow. No, 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 we don't want to do that. She's supposed to be coming here and, Via, well, and doing know. a hula for us. But we'll take anybody else. She had to work this morning. She caught the 6.15 flight out. <laughs> Worked at Starbucks at 8 o'clock. Starbucks. I finished by 1. She was a little late. She just called me, Remember but now. you'll see her. She'll be she'll be coming. Oh, no, we get traffic, not like Koala, not like Big Island. Only but get anyway. one way. We give them. Huh? Yes, yes. Yes. Okay. Hiki no, hiki no. We're staying Hilo. We're staying in Hilo. Why not? <laughs> All right. We don't we, we don't make a lineup because we never follow it, so it doesn't matter. Uh, we we always we, do. We try to for nothing. We got a whole lineup last week. We didn't even know what we would do. We had to check how many we did. We actually did five out of twelve. All we know was when was the end. Yes. Okay. It's the end. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. We gave up. What kind of song? 
the days we went to Aotearoa together. You remember. Woo! Mahalo to you, okay, sweet. Oh, okay. Like, again, a, a warm round of applause for Kumuhula Tiki Mahoy. Gracing our stage. Mahalo Nui. Beautiful indeed. Was, you know, just figure we get up and dance the hula. And enjoy some easy listening music. This song was written by our dear friend, and all of you know him very, very well. Is Frank Kavai Kapuogalani Hewitt wrote this song for the beautiful Tetiari. But in actuality, we know exactly what he was saying. He was writing about the beauty of the girls from the Isles of Tahiti, a French Tahitian Hawaiian song, just like this.
Tiare. Woo! Oh, hello, Nui. It's been a long, long time. Okay. Still watching the lineup. And to the watching phone. the news. Thank you, though. So having a beautiful time with all of you here, and of course, what a, um, you know, April Fool's, right, today, it was a funny day, right? I told my daughter, okay, I'm leaving. No, mom, you're joking. I said, no, I'm really going. It's, I thought I was giving them an April Fool's today. <laughs> but what a nice way to spend our time. Come on, what are we getting at, Nani? Scroll down, scroll down. Left, right, up. <laughs> No worries. The girl in the red holoku is on her way. No, apparently there's an accident somewhere. Okay, so. Okay, I'll Is that a good excuse? That's perfect. This hikino. Traffic, traffic. Traffic. <laughs> okay, it's either that or traffic. But. Let's do class. Okay, do something on the side. Put up for our two queens. Okay. We did this song long, long time ago. Well, actually, it's a medley. It's a medley. And long. you know this long. We call this our, because this, these people were our favorite, favorite group when we was growing up. Yes. The Hui Ohana. That was the our favorite Hui group. Ohana. <laughs> favorite group. We grew up listening. And then, then we got to meet them and we got to know them. Oh my God. That was a big deal for us. We drive home going to Kohala. I was like, wow, wow. Our wow. idols. Our idols. For sh- for, no, for real. Till today. And then um, we were, the, were adopted by the Konanui Ohana at that time, right? Yes. So, we went, we did so the these are the kind of, unions. those favorite songs of ours, yeah? Yeah, this is our favorite songs. And I think you guys will remember them too. We just make them as we go. This is the kind you just press. You, you gotta just, just press, press. <laughs> kind of press, you gotta, little bit to the right, little bit left, and up and down. Yeah. We go. The only way to go. It's the only way. No, it was so long ago, we tried to remember what was the first song <laughs> in our medley. Now we got it. It's a Hui Ohana medley. See, the Death Vamp is a classic already.
It also reminds us of your mama. Yes, totally your mama and the whole Ohana. Thank you again for those wonderful memories. Great memories. So much fun. But that only tells you how old we are. I'm just joking. Yes, we are. <laughs> <laughs> Not yet. We will. We promise. We guess. What song was that? No, Ohana. All right. Okay, let's do that. Let's do why that. not? Sure. I don't no know worry. why. <laughs> you know when girls, hula dancers land, they come in strong. Head coming in for the hula. They cut it in. It's all about the text. Oh, my. Oh, I'm, I'm trying not to. I love hula. I want to feel it here. Mm. Mm. Oh, oh. 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 This smell was oh mahalo yes klawohi lohi loa ko ulawoho mahalo. This song was written by the late Auntie Sarah Moku Pule. She's from Kohala, our hometown, and became a very prolific, pro, uh, prolific songwriter for many beautiful songs. Mahalo nui beats, and she wrote many beautiful songs because of she began to really appreciate her home, but most importantly, her husband who became my representative, Akone Pule, who the highway is named after. But she wrote this song and reminded us, as Kamali is, as very young kids, she would come with her old, her little four-string ukulele and sing to my mom and dad the melody of the songs and tell us exactly how she wants it done, but most importantly, what it meant to her. And then when we decided to um, enter the contest in 1978, See how far back our sausage curls go. But 1978, we went and did an, um, a competition, a contest with Poké Records. When there's po or actually Poké Records, they were looking for uh, Hawaiian music. And Auntie Sarah reminded us that this is a song you must do to represent your hometown. So indeed, it became my very first well-known song called No Kohala. For all of you, mahalo ka.
describe the beauty of our home and most importantly, all the different winds of Kohala. Request. You know where we are trying to talk Sunny into doing slack key for us. Of course, we're very humbled of having Uncle Led here. And um, kind of spooky because Led sitting over there. Right. <laughs> we'd be scared because we, I mean, like we said, we grew up really, really love the ohana and their music and of course uncle fred came to kohala and spent some time with us at our home and uh, all night we hear beautiful slacky playing and it was amazing the things that he shared and of course we're gonna feature sunny and uh, yeah mahalo. but before i do that before i do that before we do that <laughs> two weeks ago kawi keoli celebration outrigger kona resort so I said, I, I never put him on the, I didn't put it on the lineup. Wasn't on the lineup. But he said, hey, Slacky, my brother. Usually he doesn't say, but he says, hey, how about some Slacky? I said, he likes it's not slacky. on my oh. list, but yes, hey, we no, shall first, do it. No, first the thing, the guy in the audience. Oh, yes. Yeah, so, so earlier when we were um, doing a sound check, a guy came, and I thought, no, he cannot be following me. So I was coming this way, and I see him walking kind of fast like this, and I thought, maybe I should stop. When I stopped, he continued to come, and he came straight to me, and he said, is this the festival from before i said yeah i said and it's a free festival he said yeah this is the one yeah you still have all the slacky guitar artists i said yeah sunny lim is going to be here and there he is right over there and then sunny goes hey slacky tonight i said that man could be happy it's not even on my it's not even on my lineup but but sure let's do the slacky and he was so happy however my thing is that for nani sometimes my brother goes so fast that my nails cannot handle, especially this one. So, she shredded her nails two weeks ago, just so, so the, you know. So the next day, sure enough, gone, gone, the nail. I so now in me. the age of texting, she texts us on, she texts a picture to us. The nail is the nail. broken. Just the one nail. Gone. The, the we laughed so hard because we were talking about this in the show. She told my mother when she went into college, you know, these hands, mom, these nails will never touch another blade of grass ever. Because that we'll never summer, clean yard ever again, never. Because and she never has. Well, that summer I was going away to school. She was going, I was to, going to college. To school, but my mother made us clean yard. That's what we do for the summer. That's so That was pulling the last, <laughs> all the last gr uh, grass and um, weeds up on the side of our driveway. And so I went up to my mother. I said, you see these nails? They will never. They will never. 
<laughs> and as you can see, these nails have, because there isn't any. <laughs> but because well, I still stay take care of my mama's place, but. And but since we tell these stories of all the young days, when we was younger, <laughs> when, we, when we lived on Parker Ranch, our house we didn't have a heater. Never have so nothing. So every day you had to chop wood and make food on. So on. Nani and our oldest sister Lea Aloha, uh, Cut Amina, firewood. So now she's married to Mel Amina. They used to chop wood every day for make the fire. And when we go fishing, Nani was the best. Throw net. We had the best net drawer. Was Nani right here? Right there. Those were the but old these days. nails. You, know? you see, it came from the person because of these nails. <laughs> Never thrown a net yet. No, but no, kidding. no, no. We go camping. We're telling all of our kids the story. They're like, no way, mom. For sure. Not with these nails. Because I, I, no. I went to beauty school. That's the you school see. I went. I didn't go to college. college. Was it wasn't cosmetology. It was beauty school. <laughs> Maybe that's what we got these. Okay. <laughs> but, um, so Nani, she going cry. Well, you know, she told me outside there. But it was changing. She said, you know, when I tell this story about me playing real fast, because Sunny goes real fast and I broke my nail, I want to challenge somebody out there. If they think they can play with Sunny, I like let them try. <laughs> anybody want to anybody wanna try? Anybody play ukulele? I was like, wow. Anyone, ukulele, come no, and nani. play. It's only A and E7. A and no. E7. No, no, Nani. That's all it is. Nani, it, they want to see those it, nails it, in action. It, Let's go, right? It may, it, may look, it may look like I'm dynamic, but it's only A and E7. But yeah. it looks good, yeah. She may look dynamic, you know. But you know, you know what makes it look good is when we go like this. We know. <laughs> Neither we try to look professional because we only do we do three things. Just keep smiling. Just keep yeah. smiling. But you know, you never know how we crank up this muscle. Okay. All right. Stretch your finger, Sorry. Nani. Stretch them again. Okay. <laughs> and yeah. honey, I think your nail. I actually come to Oahu. You do I come like to Oahu. You do like this. You do like this. Go like this. The nail. We think the nail. <laughs> you see, honey. Okay, your cousin said, "Honey, fit your nail." <laughs> Two dollar more. Two dollar, Two dollar more. more. We make it more strong. We make it more easy. <laughs> Lucky. Oh, none of these muscles is flexing over here. Check your nail. Honey. You gotta get the gel. Five dollar, five dollar more. Gel. We give you five dollar more. You make this way, that way. <laughs> <laughs> 
Ay el mahalo anu nu ilo ay oko pa kahi apao ay oko mai kahi oko ke kahi no ke yala oli lo ke yala mai kahi ke kahi. We are quite humble to be here. Kuha ay mako mamu ya oko me kia loha. We are so happy to stand before all of you with just lots of humility. Thank you for loving our music, but most importantly, thank you for loving what we all do here in Hawaii. It is hula, it is mele, it is music, it is the way of our people through mele and hula. Thank you, everybody. Give yourselves a big round of applause, and everyone who is coming to celebrate this day. Our great Ali Inui set aside our aina for our people again. Mahalo puka, mahalo for having us. We thank you for taking on this kuleana to celebrate and be reminded that we not recognize the past. Then how how can we know what our future will be? And most importantly, to malama our children so they understand who came before us and made this place the way it is for each and every one of us. Through our ohana make ya loha nui, he makana ke ya no ke ya mele, my uncle George, um, uncle Jimmy Kaholokula, no kain puni om kawaii, he makana ke ya, ke loha nui vale no, aloha.
Can I get a hello? Tita. Hello. She got the mahalo nui. She went down on the noho and back up. That score is for Mary Monarch. I Five. want you to. That is beautiful. You make me cry over here. The sun here up to D. I was like, wow. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> mahalo, Tita. Mahalo. Hello, hello, everybody. One more time for the little oh, family. See. Sure. Okay. We'll go to the one. We'll do the kind of medley, you know. You know, we grew up um, very, very backyard style of um, <laughs> singing, like garage. You know, in the garage is where, we, is where we learned how to sing. But instead of doing our usual mele, our usual mele, I'm just going to do this one song. It's our favorite song from the island of Molokai. Mo, for Molokai. Oh, yeah, oh, Molokai. Molokai, Nui Ahi. Molokai, where's your hand, Molokai? Yeah, Molokai. Thank you, Auntie La, um, Auntie Nani, Auntie Lorna, and Uncle Sunny. Round of applause one more time for the Lim family, everybody. My Ohana, all the way from Kohala. I love them dearly. Ah, oh, love you guys. Oh, I know you. Yeah, let's do the bass over there. Sure. You go play upright. Yeah. Okay, how's everybody doing? How's the entertainment so far, everybody? Are you being entertained? All right. Okay, trend. I need that kind. I, I don't know where my phone says. Okay, we're going to do raffles. Hanaho. Okay, so here's the $25 raffles. We got about a thousand raffles in here. Can you see? Okay, so you, you, you're going to receive at. Um, an estimate total of about $5,785. Okay, and we got Manaola and and D Stash Hawaii, okay? Here we go, man. Hold this. Pull, on, pull one out for me. Okay, get your um, raffle tickets out, all two of you. Okay. Okay, I, I, I see a name in the back here, but I, I like to call the numbers for the suspense, yeah? For the whole puni puni. Okay, here's the numbers 547 Olelua Kolu. Lima Fafiku Zero Lua Kolu. 
Where's Lehua Lee? Eleven? Okay, you stay right there, Auntie. And what home set are you from? Oh, she's from the Kalawini home set. For those of you that remember Randy Hudno of um, 105 KNE and actually 1420 KCCN, that's the mama there. Round of applause for her to Rachel Lee of Lehua Lee. Oh, okay, okay. You know what? I have to mahalo my Ohana. Um, so again, at the Nani son is Baba. And Baba is the owner of Manaola. He's the creative genius of Manaola as well. And so they were so kind to donate all this kind, very pifi iloa kind eke. Yeah? Okay, and this is worth $10,000 <laughs> for a $25 raffle ticket. $10,000. Okay, here we go. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Lima, Ha, Hiku, Ole, Kahi, Kolu. Lima, Ha, Hiku, Ole, Kahi, Toru, Toru. Five, four, seven, zero, one, two, three. Going once, going twice. Going. Mackie, you're right here. Is that Nikki? Are you Nikki? Thank you, Nikki. Okay, Nikki Dash. <laughs> so, um, Nikki's son is from my cousin Kip Shea. And for the Shea Ohana of um, uh, Papakolea as well. And there are also Makaevis and things. Okay, we'd like to also um, do a little shout out to our, um, our vendors outside. Okay, so we got core cards and core wood earrings. Um, they have cards, stickers, and other core mail. Jeez, that's the right up. Check them out. That's core cards. Good for the Ohana games and things. And there we get Keira Organics. Everything is mea, yeah? Murky. Kind of thing. So we got what? Noni. Olena, Lokahi, and Lomi Lomi Kind Mea, Isla, Isla for Dear Life. Okay, and then we got D Stash, Vintage Aloha Wear, um, and Handmade Mea. Okay, and I'm just gonna say Mea for the next one. Okay, and then we got Jaya Studios, Hawaiian Plan, and Animal Pins, Cards, Prints, and more. So check them out out there and pocket nachos and bows. They may have run out already. I'm Lotus Creation jewelry and bags and a pacha, pacha what? Pacha mama, pacha mama creations, art prints, cards and hand printed. To read this, pacha mama. I like you say I'm pacha mama. Wait, wait, where is it? The font is too small. Punch your mouth. Punch your face. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this is punch your mama. Yeah. Yeah, punch your mama creations. Ooh, really peel out kind of name, yeah? Punch the mother. Ooh, art prints, cards, and hand printed. Okay, we're going to give one more raffle away. Again, for Manaola. Zach, Carissa folks at Manaola, we love them. Okay. Oh, at an estimate of about $785, Kanaloa Pareo Lava Lava, what you may want to call it. Okay, here we go. And the number is Lima Hiku. Oh, sorry. Lima Ha Hiku Ole Ole Kolu. Lima Ha Hiku Ole Ole Kolu. Lima Fa Fiku Zero Zero Tolu. Going once. And it's done. One more time, baby. Nobody. Okay. Where's the guy in Eli? Who? We know who is spend money here. She's smart. Where? Her? Five four seven zero one five zero one five five four seven 
0015. So everybody, that's Nikki, okay? Um, Nikki works upstairs in a, um, her building. She does. Uh, she has a photography business as well. She's awesome. Here you go. Huh? Yeah, I told you, seven hundred fifty dollars worth, loving. But you know what? I think you, we should auction this on you. What this? What this? Are you? Are you? Yeah, yeah. Can you make that? <laughs> okay, folks. Um, I'd like to. Um, where's Elijah? Okay, folks. At this time, I'd like to call up my nephew Elijah Kala McShane. Um, they, he he also comes from Kevalo Homestead, Kevalo Papakolea, Kalawahine. Um, his family um, hails. One of his lines hails from. Maui, the Mahaulu family, and we're gonna have um, if, if we, as soon as we read over there, we're gonna have Kala come to the stage and just um, do a little hi, a little presentation of Kuhio and um, whatever mails that he may want to share with us. Put your hands together for Eli Kala McShane, check him out on Instagram, TikTok. Aka, my lord, is my nephew. Aloha mai kako, aloha mai kako, o Elijah Kala McShane ko inoa piha, uh, no hale iwa pa alaa, uh, ka moku o waialua mai au, uh, ka moku pune o kaku hi hewa. Yeah, as Uncle Puka said, I'm a McShane, I come from Ani Ani Ku, aloha ohana over there, been there since the beginning of Papakole Homestead. Um, and you know, he put me up to come speak about Kuhio, so I was like, hey, you know what, what I gotta talk about Kuhio? One of the most... Uh, inspirational mo lelo kuhio that is pretty funny too is when he was going to school abroad yeah um east coast of america and in europe and this is in you know the kind of 1880s 1890s and you're talking about this kanaka uh he experiencing plenty racism abroad and people didn't really know that he was an ali'i of the hawaiian kingdom and of hawaii but lucky enough he was on Lua Expert, and he was good at martial arts, and he could box. So, has a good mo'olelo, he stay in the barber shop. Hey, hey, has a guy act up with him. Oh, he drop him. Pop, pop, boom. I was like, oh, Hawaiian gotta be from Papakolea. <laughs> like a whole about his Hawaiian. Yeah, and, and so, hey, guys, you know, all the inspiration of Kuhio and who he is to our people is so uh, important for us in our time and uh, in the space and time of the third Hawaiian Renaissance of seeing our people all... Uh, Ho ulu kala hui, ho ala kamana o, ho ala kala hui, Hawaii. It's been beautiful to see us come together and to commemorate our ali'i in a way that uh, has only been expanding since the overthrow. And so, uh, peace and love to all of our kupuna, for everybody over here uh, who all actually put all their mana on the line on a beautiful evening on a Saturday come spend the day and to be in support of Papakolea Homestead spent all of my life in Papakolea lived all of my life in Waipahu I now live Hale Iva but every weekend I stay Papakolea if you come um, to speak to our Ohana we stay Ani Aniku Street so hey hey le mai peace and love guys ahoy ho malama ponno
Check this thing one two. Oh, lovely. Two two two. Check one two. Yeah. Mic check one two one two. Mic two, check two, one two. two. One, two. Mic. Testing one two. Testing <laughs> one two. Check one two. <laughs> two two. Check one two. More bass, brother. Thank you. Testing one two. Check one two. Yeah, more up in the monitor. I think it's in the middle. More bass in the monitor? Yeah, a little more. Yeah, if can if can some more. More. introduce the next group <clears throat> and we want to say mahalo to the kitchen crew um, which consists of all families all my cousins so your cousin Shana Awau uh, my cousin Turi Halemanu Asing yeah. Wallace uh, um, Corey Mao who's a part of the group um, Keolu went on a um, news this morning BDV called us thanks to Tita Mele there was an open slot this morning so um, he went on at about 8 o'clock this morning and spoke about Hanohano Kuhio today. So we got him. Um, we got also Randy Wakini Kona Wong, who did all our lovely decorations. Um, he hails also, he's a dancer of Kabaili Ula under my hula brother Chinky Mahoy as well. And then who else? And then my, this is one of my Hamana, my cousin Haoli. Um, she is of the. Um, the Ohana, uh, the the uh, Medeiros Ohana, but they're also Poai Puni Pu'u, Pu'u line as well. And she's Ohana to me. She's also my Mrs. Mokihana uh, when my Hala entered in the Mokihana competition in Kauai, yeah. and she's gonna do a yes. number two. So they work in the kitchen, they dance with her, they clean, they go home, fix car, build house. That's Papa Kola for you, Hi. right? <laughs> Ew. Okay. Yeah? Change tire. Yeah, she fixed car. Change tire. Okay. 
So mahalo to the kitchen crew as well. Thank you very much, everybody. Okay, this next group is... Uh, and I'm not, I'm not bullshitting. Okay, this is my Oana too. So this is my cousin. This is Kapua. Aloha. She's from the Ching Ohana. The Ching family. Uh, the Ching family. <laughs> on Iokea Street, um, her papa is Joe Ching. And, oh. uh, and the grandmother is Vehilani Ching. But she's a hard bottle of the hard <laughs> bottle um, Ohana, right? For your genealogist fa family in here. Are you genealogist? I'm Manuai. Kamae na kena, eh? Oyapu. And so, she's also the daughter of Bernard Kalua, the original Ikona. So, Uncle Ledward um, had a group called Ikona, which was Alika Nana. Yeah. Who was it? The original the first one. Bernard Uncle, Kalua. Uncle Led and Uncle, Uncle Alika Led Odom. and Uncle Alika Odom. So, that was um, Uncle Bernard Kalua. He was also in the Blalas of Kiaokaha, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. My cousin Kapua. How's about a round of applause for her? Aloha. Songs like Palolo, Royal Hawaiian Hotel. Shell gas. Shell oil gas. Shell oil gas. Shell oil gas is another Hawaiian song. It sounds funny, but they're recording it. And they're going to come up with a shell oil gas. That's the name of the song. The great grandmother is none other than Mary Pula'a Robbins. She is a haku mele. Um, Olala Makuahine, Manaleo, as the term they use nowadays. My cousin, Pauline, oh, Pauline, Lena Robbins. I'm going to see Pauline Kekauna. <laughs> Pauline Robbins, my cousin. Uh -huh. This is number five. We call him number five. He's my brother, Aina, on the guitar. He's a Hawaiian language teacher. Um, he teaches uh, music in hula. One of his haumana is here too as well, Hi. which we're going to have come up a little bit so later. Hi. And um, he's my fifth brother. And that's my mom in the back there. She had all 17 of us. Yeah, my mom is old school. Like all the tutus you come from with 17, 21 children. My mother had 17 too. And he's five of 17. <laughs> Put your hands together, ladies and gentlemen, for the one, the only, the three. Small cards. Uhe uhe Aloha mai kakoa paolo e ko Hawaii mai kahiki na kala puka i hae hae kala pu e e ko mohana ano le la ho i ke aloha i nei nei mo ili ili nei me ke aloha i kakoa paolo. Hano hano Kuhio, we like to send our aloha to you folks, especially to Kuhio, Kelly Makaai Nana, and we like to do this medley of Aina Ho Opulo Opulo. Oh, 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 
composed by Kumuhula, Samuel Kamuela Nayole. So, if Auntie, you know this one and you want to come up and dance it, please feel free. Once again, Vilina May Meke Aloha. We're so happy to be here. We are Uhe Uhene, Kapu Kalua, Lina Robbins, Aina Singh. And again, the reason why we're here is one individual who really represents all of our kupuna because they really all had the same thinking. And so his name is Kelly Makaainana, Prince Kuhio Kalaniana Ole. How about 10 more claps for him? Because without him, many of us Hawaiians wouldn't have Aina. And cousin, what did they say that his original intent wasn't? 50%. What was it said before, cousin? Oh, I, I believe it was uh, 164th. That was the blood quantum, the original um, ask. And then you know how America does what America does, right? They kept on increasing it and increasing and increasing. And so now today we're at, um, to be able to qualify as a, um, a beneficiary of I know how Opula Pula, you have to be a 50% um, quantum, blood quantum to be allotted a parcel of land. And to inherit, you have to be 25%. And so, how many of you folks in here live on the land? With a show of hands, how many of you folks? How many of us folks live on Aina Ho'opulopula? Yeah. Yeah. Give us a round of applause, yeah? And even if you, and even if we, we don't live on Aina Ho'opulopula, because currently I live in Makiki, it's okay, because one day we will, right? And, you know, uh, some, um, I can't even remember his name right now, but he said, don't, you know, this is the time for us to live on the land. Don't die on the list. So, you know, if you, if you are able to, just holomua, go let, try it. We got to keep trying, right? We got to keep trying. But for those of us who cannot... We honor Kuhio through Mele, through Hula, and so that's why we're all here today to honor um, Kelly Imakainana, Prince Jonah Kuhio Kalaniana Ole, P.E. Koi Oku. So? Mahalo. And at this time, we like to, speaking of Makiki, we like to take it home 
where many of us, uh, our Ohana is from, and many of us are here. Yeah. Uh, in fact, the, many of the community of Papakulia came to help set this up. So we'd like hey. to take you to that Aina Ho'opula Pula uh, with this song composed by Annie Kalama. Yeah. If we could get our cousin Nessie, Miss Mokihana 2004 hey. of Halau Kuali'i to come and do a hula for you folks. And right before we do that, we're going to call up a Koopa, another Koopa of Papakulia. Her name is Po Maikai Lyman. We call her Mandy. Round of applause for Auntie Genoa's granddaughter, but her own name po, and po her my, own glory. Po, po Maikai Mandy Lyman. Po, po Maikai, well, no, Po Maikai. Oh, I forgot about that. Okay. Po Maikai, yeah, Ke Ave. Po Maikai Poi now. Now we can in, uh, actually have her talk more because her her tutu, Auntie Genoa, Kiave, I, I want to say is, is known for singing this song. This is Pumai Kai. Yeah, po- she, she's just a one namer now, yeah? Pumai Kai. One namer. <laughs> but, but, but you can introduce your whole name. One, two, oh, check. Aloha. 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 Uh, once again, yes. I'm, I'm, I use the name that Tutu gave me. It's actually Pomaikai. And then the rest of the Mo'olelo. Pomaikai Malie Ke Kuini Aloha O Kalani is the given name from my Tutu. And I always say Amanda was the name that my parents gave. Shh, don't tell. Um... And then Keave is my Inoa Ohana uh, for my kupuna. And then Fatongia is the name I chose, the new name, yeah? So say aloha to my Kane over here. <laughs> Wilson, Wilson. <laughs> and so, um, yes. Very, very, very um, proud and blessed. I feel blessed, you know, and, and Po Maikai has allowed me to realize how much, how, ma- how many blessings I really do have in my life. And so one of those blessings is to be able to, um, to be able to have been born and raised in Papakolea around so many aunties, uncles, kupuna, and also all of my hoahanao, um, who have helped to give me experiences and counsel uh, to allow me to grow into the wahine, the makua that I am today and be able to pass that along, know what my kuleana is to pass that forward to the next generation, our keiki. And so I do that now as makua hine and also as kumu, um, makekula. And so I have the blessing of being able to work with organizations that teach the youth in our within our Papakolea community um, in addition to others and so we let, we want to honor our our home and mahalo how about another round of applause for Uhe Uhene sounding lovely as usual Okay, I'm going to do one of my favorite songs for you. Oh my god. Oh, he 
Because of Kavahi? Pomai Kai. And Pomai Kai. Our, our Tita Arho Hanao Kavahi Mahalo Nui. Okay, I think we're gonna. I'm following your folks' lead. Are we doing our mele now or later? Okay. I don't know if he's he's probably in the back right now. Um, maybe I want to call him out, but Enosa is with me. Um, Enosa. Okay, so this is my nephew, Nosa Boy, we call him Enosa. And I'm and he's at uh, St. Louis High School, Kan Louis. For my brother Kahale Lau Mane Mamane Hoke over here. Class of ninety-two. Yeah, that's what happens when he, he's all over the place. He had sports this morning, so he forgot the um, palule aloha, lole aloha. So, la keke it is. He's going to take us over to the island of Maui where I have my um, makuahine side. My mom is from upcountry Maui. Um, and, I, you know, I fall in that... That category only can inherit, no can apply. Yeah? Because my mom is not of Hawaiian descent, even though she looks like the Filipino Puerto Rican look. Um, but yes, anyway, this is Enosa. He's going to do for you Ulu Palakua. Might I add, he plays a mean steel guitar oh, and yeah. sings very well. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. Yeah? You know, was this a song we recorded? You want to come? Come, come sing with me. So, you know, when, when, this, when this young man was first, 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 first getting on a mic and in front of a camera, this is one of the songs that we got to record. I, I, how old were you at that time? Maybe like, yeah, seven, eight, <laughs> eight or nine. Um, anyway, everyone, this is Kamaha'o. We had the chance of recording this song with Auntie Kelly when we were at his um, kula, Kawaikini, and in, in, on the island of Kauai, but the song that takes us over to Maui, upcountry Maui, will do for you Ulu Palakua. Right?
Would you like to join us for this last song? No. With Tutu's song. So, yeah, he can do it. He's been, he's been working on his falsetto lungs. So. Yeah. You know, when people ask what, what I've been up to lately, this, this is it really, you know, uh, working with the keiki in, at home and at school. And so um, I, think I'm, I think I'm still fulfilling my kuleana. <laughs> Um, yes, we're all singing it, Mary. Okay. We only do this in one key. And if you feel like singing, we all have a little bit of um, wannabe Genoa in us. You know, we've all wanted to try to sing Alika. So if you feel like singing, now is the time. We're the ones on the mic. You folks don't have anything. Don't have anything to worry about except the loved one that you came with next to you today who can who rags on you anyway. Yes.
I'd like to say mahalo to Pumay Kai and her son Inosa and our dear friend over here. Kamahao. Back by the best. Another round of applause for Uhe Uhene. Mahalo. They're not done. We still have to do our mele. Okay, at this time, we like to bring Miss Mokihana 2004. How Oli Castro from Papakolia talking about her home, Papakolia, with a song composed by Annie Kalama called Papakolia. Please enjoy Miss Moki Hanna. more songs to share with you folks. Okay, so the spotlight has been directed into the table in front of me. This table of Nakumu Hula. This is Vahia Puka, so don't be mad at me. Uncle Chinky, Puka, yeah. Not too fast. Hepa kika, hepa hee. Nice. 
I love it. Oh, yeah. going to do a song uh, taking you to the ocean uh, composed by the songbird of Hawaii Antilina Machado taking you on a, a canoe ride referencing the up and down motion of going over the waves love story but don't forget port hard now that I work on a boat I know what port is number or you want to do your own number <laughs> he said he'll eat you but what uh, I uh, oko keloha oh yeah keloha yeah okay yeah a nice speed yeah nakumuhula calling on nakumuhula to come over here and do uh keloha the love song composed by auntie Leigh collins and maddie lamb now this comes from your family yes i love this story do you want to tell it? Because Uncle Ed told this so, so great, and I tell it all the time now. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so um, my husband is a, um, actually a Naukana, and his, uh, his auntie is who this song was written for. Um, and um, it is known that um, Uncle Analu was much older then she, I mean, no, she was older than Uncle Analu. And they said, oh, they're not going to last a year. They're not even going to last. Because she played music out in, you know, you know, she was a musician. And, you know, things are not going to work out. But one year came, and he loved her more than anything else. And therefore, they went and they wrote this song for, for Auntie and gave it to her on that day of her anniversary. So this is the song, Kia Aloha. Yes. And, and, and Uncle Ed said, behind every good man is a good woman. And so true, right? <laughs> yes. But in this yeah. case of Ke Aloha, behind every good woman is a younger man. That's Which okay. True. That's, not, that's true. not the story here. Yeah, Auntie. <laughs>
I think we're done. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're, we're done, right? Paul ready? Okay. Well, mahalo nui for coming yes. down to Hano Hano Kuhio. Um, it's a pleasure for us to come down and spend the uh, afternoon with you folks. Once again, we are Uhe Uhene. We have our cousin Aina sing on the guitar. Kapua Kalua on the upright bass. My name is Lina. Um, we give you folks with one more song. Yeah. I, I, who's coming up? Do we know who's coming up? I see hula dancers outside, so I'm assuming hula. Yeah. Well, mahalo for joining us to our sound man over there. Mahalo, mahalo, mahalo. Our, our special guests are Ohana Komaika'i. And uh, our many dancers, Kawahi, Kawoli, and our Nakumuhula, Eha. And uh, to Kaze Puka, mahalo for having us, inviting us to celebrate and honor Kelly Makainana, Jonah Kuhi, Prince Jonah Ku, Kuhio, Kalaniana Ole, Piikoi Oku. My cousins. I forgot to introduce my cousins. Aina Asing, Lena Robbins, myself Kapo Kalua. We are Uhe Uhene. Mahalo, mahalo, mahalo. Oh, oh you folks are drinking in here. Oh, I didn't know we were drinking in here. Okay. You drinkers out there.
Love them. Hello. Hello. Okay, we're going to hand the whole one for all the hula dancers in the house. Since it's Mary Monarch in a couple of weeks, um, we want to celebrate the 60th anniversary of uh, um, the Mary Monarch Hula Festival. So we're going to get all the hula dancers to stand up and Papalina Lahi Lahi, your call is off. Okay, here we go, Papalina Lai Lai. Oh 
Mahalo, aloha. Mahalo. Once again, a round of applause for Uhe Uhene. Their CD will be coming out in a couple of months, folks, with a lot of flowers in their hair. Thanks. What about giving yourselves the hula dancers another round of applause? Okay, hold on. Okay, folks, um, once again, mahalo for coming and joining us today. Is everybody having a good time? Yeah? Okay. Did anybody buy more raffle tickets? Or are you going on? You're just hoping we're going to put the right one. Okay. Once again, mahalo for all the vendors um, that we have. Okay. Bella, Bella. Okay, we're gonna call on the raffle, another raffle. Okay, this is um, made by Meraki. It's a handmade lamp, very interesting for $25 raffle tickets. It's worth fifteen thousand dollars. <laughs> you like my whole puni puni, yeah? Okay, five four seven zero zero nine. Five four seven zero zero nine. We got a winner, huh? Five four. Kelohi, Kelohi. That's yours. What oh, is Uluvehis? Okay, so this is Kelohi and Trinity. They work here at the Vibe by Collective for Mahina Paishan. Duarte, this is her whole place here, and they're so they're so wonderful. They're so good workers. Work hard. Akamai, Akamai Yalawa. Okay, five four seven zero zero nine. Going once, going twice. We only get so much tickets. Okay, that one. Okay, that one. Go on. Okay, hello. Give me that one. Okay, for seventeen thousand dollars. <laughs> Made by Kalakoa Designs. D Stash, where are you, D Stash? Okay, D Stash is outside. Okay, here's the number uh, 547027. Okay, 547027. Oh, we got a winner! All right, brother. Thank you. I'm not even checking. You can put it to me, I'm going to give them to you. Wow. Okay, well, let's, let's see what we got on here. Once again, yeah. Manaola. He was so gracious to give us all this mea. So, so wonderful, yeah. This is what, what kind of... Um, how is this? Anybody can tell me. You get them if you know what it is. Hurry up. Huh? No, what the la'au on top? What is the la'au, mercy? Huh? Palapalai or pala'a? Okay, if it's palapalai, raise your hand. If it's pala'a, raise your hand. It's leather fern, you all lose. <laughs> okay, we're going to call a number. What else we get over there? Let's do some trivia. Okay. Five for seven. We're going to next group. going to be coming up soon. <clears throat> five for seven. Zero. One. Two. Five for seven. Zero. One. Two. Did, did you get it? Five for seven. Zero one two. Get all kind of other stuff in. I don't like to tell nobody. They're gonna be J. Let me see. Let me see. That's Lou, everybody. It's my my pal. Okay. When the grand prize coming? 
with the knee house shells, the kahile lani. You didn't make the thousand dollar raffle already, huh? Nobody bought the thousand dollar raffle. We ain't giving away the ten shan kahile lani then. Who? In okay, this is for um. This print is called. Let me read it. Where's our next band? Can we tell our band stop being milli million? Hurry up. Okay. Okay, this is called Kino Lao. It's a Manaola collection, okay? So there's usually a Mo'olelo, but I oh, no more my glasses. Maka pora eye already. We're going to try. Everything we do has deep spiritual significance. Behind in every pattern, print, and drop of paint emanates an ancient and sacred genealogy that touches our spiritual eyes no matter one's culture. We are all the same in spirit. Hawaiian fashion transcends time and space as it lives and breathes creation through its connection with nature and the balance of heaven earth and sea mana ola yap everybody how's that for hai olelo okay here's the trivia question okay that that's our auntie that's auntie cc everybody silver she's 90 years old and she's going to be 91 in may everybody round of applause for auntie she's colarian Okay, so here's the trivia question. Since this is Manaola, this is a Manaola um, Eke, tell me what is the Ohana that is related to Auntie Miriam? You can say one of two names if you know. So it's a Kohala family. Mary, we know, of course, this is who they're related to. Not Lim. How much wine you had? We know it's Lim. There's two family names that connect to the Lim family. Huh? It's direct. It's a direct link to Auntie Miriam. Marianne. Lim. Nobody? Who, who said him? Who said Lincoln? Oh, you're the winner, the babies. Right there, Helm is the winner. She know. It's a well, round of applause right there. Clap, everybody. Don't be nails, or it's time for you to all leave. <laughs> okay. Oh, we got one more. Huh? 25. Okay, here's another one. Just a bag. Going at $785. dollars Five four seven zero two one. Five four seven. Zero two one. Ah, Auntie from the PCDC table. How lovely. I'm gonna play. Oh. You go outside. Let me move. Yeah. All set up already. Yeah. Oh, five four seven zero two one. That's the winner. Thank you, Auntie. Thank you for your um, your raffle. Mahalo, Dewey. Okay. So I just like tell you guys a little story. So this is my base, and um. Auntie Lorna was playing it, but get on big crack over here. But she's still cunny. You would never know, yeah? Super glue, yeah, Chinks? Thank you. Um, you know, I'd like to say mahalo to my hula brother, to Chinky Moho, and, and his wife that um, were able to make it today. I love them very dearly. Award winning Halal Mary Monarch. And, and then also, Uncle Kuneva, here with Hula Halal Kamuela, and they will be, be performing last with Kalani Pea. And about 500 dancers. They're going to be dancing on the tables, dancing in the rafters, one, two, in the bathroom, three. everywhere. One, two. Okay. Can, can I borrow one dancer? Yeah, we can borrow one dancer. The main kumu, ladies and gentlemen, Kawi Onalani Kapanao has entered the building. <laughs> Hurry up. So we're gonna play with our cousin, um, Raiyatea. Yeah. Anybody can tell me if they know any one of her genealogies that comes out of the Hana lines for a prize. What we get over there? We get
given her a lamb. Huh? Okay, tell me one genealogical name if you want to perform. I'll give you one hint from Hannah. It starts. The, the volume is okay. It starts with a K. And I cannot give you any hint. No. I, I, I cannot give you. No, just sorry. Look at Jinky. <laughs> okay, I'm the Jinky. Uh, no, no, no. You, you may not because if I give the hint, I don't know. I, I may give it away. Okay, get ready. It's how fast you can yell, man. I'm going, this for this beautiful from Jah- Jahir, Jahir. Jahair, Jahair Studio, hard enamel pin. So here's the hint. John and Jerry. Say them loud. John and Jerry. Winner. Who said Coco? Hurry up. Ladies and gentlemen, she was a dancer a little bit earlier. This is Leva Lansardia. Put your hands together for Leva Lansardia. My cousin. Thank you. I'm going to have him come to us. Um, Mele Foss too. Yeah? So uh, my grandmother was Melanie Coco, also known as May. And uh, Uncle John and Jerome's father and my grandma were siblings. And they grew up in Pukuilua, in uh, Kipahulu, in Hana. Awesome, huh? You love that. Okay, check this mic, brother. Check, check. One, two. Two, check two. We're going... A little bit a little wettage. A little bit wettage. Reverberage. Yeah. Okay, check, check, check. One, two, two. I don't know how to play bass. I'm going to try. Test one, two, one, two. All right. How's everyone doing? Aloha. So nice to be here at Vai Vai. Mahalo to Puka and uh, his gang. Also Mahina, uh, Keoki, all the wonderful folks that keep this place going. Oh, we have some TV streaming. Oh, Evie, all right. I love it. So I'm I'm honored to get to perform with Puka and Sean Na'awao. My goodness, so, so honored. No, uh, we're just going to kanikapila some songs. And there's actually a couple that I haven't done in a while. We're going to start... We're going to start with this one. <laughs> I recorded an album in was it 2004. 2004, I released Sweet and Lovely. Um, you guys remember Tower Records? Where was Tower Records located? Where? No, the, the one on KL Moku. Remember that one? Yeah. Oh. That's is where Walgreens stay now, yeah? The Tower or Records used to be, on the yeah. corner, yeah? Walgreens. Yeah. Tower Records. So um, one of my mentors, Tony Conjugation, wrote this song in, in honor of his mentor, Antiviki E. Rodrigues. And um, she loved the yellow rose. And he also highlights um, that famous wind in... I believe it's in Palolo, yes, and that is the Waiopua wind. And he also recognizes Lehua, which is one of the first groups that she started, that she um, brought together. A song entitled Kaloke Polena.
Classic by John Camiloha Alameda, Miley Swing. So we're here to celebrate Kuhio. Yes, uh, I am very, very grateful for him and the fact that I was one of the, we would say, one of the few who are were fortunate to live on uh, Hawaiian homestead. How many of you folks? Lived or live on the homestead. Okay, so how many of you are on the list? Still waiting on the list? Okay, only get few, okay, but we still have many folks on the list, right? But there's something uh, special about growing up on, uh, on that, well, especially on Molokai, we have a lot of red dirt. And there's something about that, that uh, lepo, whew, it's good for you. <laughs> but, um, you know, our family established that, um, you know, presence on, on the homestead in the 40s where my father's parents uh, moved from Maui. And then they, they made home at, in Kalamaula with my, my father and uh, six of his siblings. So they lived off the aina, they farmed, they uh, lived a simple life, but they also had so much fun. And then my, my father was able to continue that on the other side of the road. So we're still close to grandma's uh, home. But uh, going back to Maui, we're going to take you to the year of 1915, a song written by Scott Ha'i. speaks of a kind of a very jealous mountain song entitled Ahu Lili.
guys. Oh. Uh, this song was written by Kumu John Kaimikawa. Um, he would frequent Molokai when I was uh, a little girl, and I always looked forward to his uh, coming over because we would get really excited of his uh, storytelling and his sharing of the old Molokai, of the, the myths and legends and some of the spooky stories. But, um, you know, growing up, I was very close with my tutu of uh, Hanapepe Kawaii, and she would always love to come and, uh, and visit with him. So he writes this song, taking us to the highest peak of Molokai, which is Kamako, and he speaks of this particular maile that only grows up in that area. It is called Kaluhea, and also um, Kaluhea means when you give someone a lei and you remove that lei, that smell still lingers um, on that, that person. A song that he also honors the, uh, the high priest Lanikaula of Molokai, a mele entitled Kuupua Kukui o Kamako.
you. Mahalo. So I like to do a medley of songs, one written by Leigh Collins and Helen Lindsay Parker. We're going to take you to um, Kalaupapa. Helen Lindsay Parker wrote Olu Opu'ulani for um, her nephew, who was very, very young, and he contracted the Hansen's disease and was sent over to Kalaupapa to live. Um, so she wrote this for him. And to, you know, share with him that to nev- never to uh, forget your home up here. And then, of course, uh, Baby O Pu'ulani, written by Leigh Collins, celebrates the name and the, the connection of, of place. A song entitled Baby O Pu'ulani and Olu O Pu'ulani.
variety of helm, everybody. Nahoku, Hano Hano Award winner. How's about a Hano Ho? Hano Ho! Thank you, folks. Mahalo Nui. Everybody feeling? Everybody all right? You need some beer? You need some wine? <laughs> all you need is God. Mahalo kia ko no ke iala no kalaho po mai ka iya kako apau mahalo. We like to say also mahalo. You see this brother in the papale? He is Keoni Willings of the Heva Heva Nui line. He is also the general manager of Vai Vai Collective. How about a round of applause for him as well? So, folks, we're so honored um, again to have everybody here this today. What a wonderful event! Uh, Apelila One Akahi celebrating Prince Jonah Kuhio Kuhio Kalaniana Ole, and he was known as our Keli Makainana. And so, we're so thankful that uh, we're here today, especially for our Ohana that was blessed with homestead. We like to also. Send our aloha out for those that are still waiting on the the waiting list. So we pull it at hopefully in this time with the Kalima case and all those things that has opened up uh, for our Hawaiians to be able to, you know, reap the benefit that the Keali Makainana had um, ho- makaukau for us. So one of applause for Kuhio Kalaniana Olea, our Keali Makainana. Mahalo nui, kamo'i. Okay, folks, so we're going to set up. So we have Hula Halau Kamuela coming up, as well as Grammy Award winner Kalani Pea. So stick around. We're going to have dancers everywhere. So uh, Makau Kau, here we go. It's going to be a lot of energy. We're going to close the curtains. We're going to turn the lights down. Nah, we're going to act it. <laughs> Mahalo again for joining us. Anybody need more? Mea Ai? Mea Ono? 
Everybody okay? Everybody speak English? Okay, mahalo.
check one, two. Hey, hey, one, two. Put some reverb.
Belina Mikelo Yakako Pakaya Pau, Aloha Vai Vai Collective. Oh, you guys can clap. <laughs> we just flew in 10 minutes ago from Maui. I just to put my deodorant on and we're good to go. But uh, thank you so much, Puka. Papa Kolea, Mahalanui, a Vai Vai Collective. Kalani Pia, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, I told you he was going to be here. Mahalo I'm here. Nui. I'm here Grammy for Award you. winner na hoku hano hano. Makolelo makua hine. Oh. Matona wali ili. Mahali a yesu. Aleva wi ai ki ki kai me ando ka me ke vi ne ki kino. Kama hope pono ke ya. Aya na wina me a. Mafeta pa ina no. Aka ke la ka me. Ladies and gentlemen, Kalani Fea. Oh, this is a PG-13. PG-13. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to sing some mele for you with acoustic style with Wild Out Rider. Please give a round of applause. Yes, our babies. Oh, you guys can space out or... Okay. Well, this first mele is a mele that has been done many, many times. And one of my favorite female vocalists is Auntie Loyal Garner. And I wish I met her... Um, when I was a senior at Kekula o Navahi o Kalani o Pu'u, Hawaiian Immersion Program, and I graduated from Navahi. She passed away in 2001, one of my favorite vocalists, and she sings this song to honor her sister, Alicia Smith, to honor the essence of hula and the perpetuation of hula. E yahoi keia mele, no kamehe mele ia, e swish and sway, goes something like this. To the swish and the sway of the Ulani Shall we dance to the Ibukulele? Shall we move to the steel guitar? Won't you feel the enchantment of the Kumu Hula stance? You be touched by Elakae. For the beginning, shall we dance to the Ipueke? Shall we move to the beat of the drums? Exciting motion, weave a spell of devotion to the swish and the sway of the Ulani. Thank you, babies. Yes. Okay. Go eat. Go eat. Yes. Hele, hele, Oko. Well, um, it's an honor to be here to celebrate love, hula, mele, and storytelling. And forgive me, I'm just going through this head cold, really bad head cold. And uh, so I'm going to try my best. And I'm so honored to tell you guys that... Um, I have good news. I saved lots of money by switching to Geico. But anyway, <laughs> also I have also good news. I also received a letter that I have homestead on Maui. 
April Fools. I just, <laughs> I just, I'm still waiting. I just, I just wanted to do that. Sorry. <laughs> that was an April Fools joke. Anyway, but mahalo to Prince Kuhio and his legacy. I'm a fourth generation homesteader of Kyokaha and Paneeva, so we celebrate that. Celebrate his legacy. This next melee is from my hometown Hilo. Eyohoi o Hilo, I see you. It's a melee I composed to honor. Um, Nopaka Govea, a dear friend of ours. And Nopaka Govea comes from Pukalani, Maui, and talks about her, compared her beauty to the Nopaka Okekai and Nopaka Ouka, and how she flourished so beautifully. Aole Ma'e Ele Ikekino, so that her flower doesn't stay dry, you know, because. The flower or the plant need photosynthesis, which I've learned in eighth grade. You need sun and water for it to ho'omohala and mahua'e. And so without photosynthesis, it'll be a poor thing. You guys get it? Okay, anyway, this is not Kalani's comedy scene. I just got off the plane. But hele aloha no hilo. I would like to welcome Hula Hala Okamuela to the stage again with this original mele. Please welcome. Oh, Kubu Hula Kami Kavana. Give it up, Kubu Kavana. Yes. And of course, we took second place in Awana 2019. Ladies and gentlemen, from, I'll have to do this, from Waimanalo and Kali Oahu, under the direction of Kumuhula. No, I have to, have to, I love you, Uncle Kunava. I love you. Hele aloha no hilo. For you, Napaka, go something like this. Clap your hands like the sound of hilo. Like the sound of hilo. Himanu. Himanu hilo itu pua. Hikapua lake kawika ono hi. Hiya ai kamana o ikikiu. Like Japan, come Can you give a round of applause for all the vendors out there, all the local vendors and food? I just bought me a purple palaka bag. <laughs> Mary Monarch. For those who don't know, purple is my favorite color in the world. My hat is purple and my malo is purple. <laughs> anyway, but um, I am a 
going to do this next mele. I wrote this mele um, that talks about change. And uh, my last name is Pe'a. People always ask me if I'm Samoan. I'm not related to the rock. I'm Hawaiian from Kalapana Puna. And um, my ohana. Yes, please clap, please. My tutus. And um, I love my kupuna. Of Puna Paya Alekahala. And, um, and this song talks about my tutu Kane, who was a fisherman and also a musician of Puna. Curtis Iaokea Pe'a. And the second verse talks about Kalakawa. As Kalakawa traveled all over the world, I love that king so much. He was a king of modern, just being that modern Kanaka, a king of innovation, new ideas and creativity. And, um, and the, the king himself who revitalized Mele and Hula during the times that it was banned, during the times that our kupuna were forbidden to speak. The times when my parents didn't show Kapu Aloha in the late 80s, trying to establish Hawaiian language programs in Navahi and Ahapuna Leo as a young child seeing our kumu and our kupuna fight for the resurgence of Olala Hawaii. And the third verse talks about Kamehameha, Ekahi and his legacy. And the last verse is for all of you, for our kupuna. And I wrote this during the pandemic after my show at the Lincoln Center in New York City, February 2020. We all lost our jobs. And this song talks about all of us charting our own sail, that we must chart our own voyage, kaukapea a holokava'a, and have, we have to adapt to change and be effective to change. So Wailau and I wrote this ballad together, which won Song of the Year at the Hoku Awards last year. Clap for Wailau. He worked hard in dealing with me. Mahalo. <laughs> All right. This mele is for you. May you find your own journey as we're coming back into some sort of this reality of coming together, celebrating each other, protecting each other with love and aloha. Here's the mele. Go. No Kalakawa E e mai me kai ku ona lani i kai mi pono i kai pu me na ali nui a tanua no kamalu ma.
I'm so hungry. <laughs> I'm going to eat right after this. I cannot wait. Oh, oh my God, the granddaughter, you know, k e a v e I'm sweaty. Nothing's too much coming from you, my love. Thank you. Um, I'm so happy to be here because, you know, Maui, no more good Chinese Korean food. Get panda. Only get Panda Express. <laughs> you guys have the best Korean Chinese food. I love Golden Duck, but I don't like MSG. <laughs> but I love <laughs> Golden. Anyway, um, I love you, Puka. Thank you. So that mele is for you, and um, this next mele, you know. Oh, thank. Oh, my husband! Give him a round of applause. He always tell everybody that he's the boss, and that is accurate. <coughs> no, this next melee is uh, thank you, brother. Oh, I have one. Um, Alan would put one purple, the purple towel for me. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, this purple is the best color in the world. Okay, okay, okay. Um. This next mele is a um, a fun mele I did from my first album. If you know this song, come dance. If you don't know this song, I only p l a here. But I like to do it in my version because why? Okay, okay, okay. Have you ever sat? I'm a big boy, and I really don't like sitting on these kind chairs. So Hawaiians, we don't sit on plastic chairs. Yeah, the kind like from Costco's and and you know these kind. This is for like Asia or skinny people. We like the core chair, yeah, the hard rock, you know, rocking chair from one of surf rider status, yeah. Because you know this song talks about that sitting comfortably on a chair. And when your loved one tells you to sit down with you on a hard, rocking chair, you better sit down on that chair. Sorry, this is a PG-13 event. <laughs> We have a child over here. 14. And you know, this song was written by a prolific artist that we all know. Johnny Almeida, and I had to do it my style. So Kumuhula, overall award-winning Kumuhula. c h i k i m o h if you know this, m e l e come dance. If you know, like it's all good. If can, can. If no, can. Vernas. Okay, here's this m e l e Go something like this. Here we go. Here we go. Bubuay hawau imehana one yanda o sedubali. Me alanoi, 
Watching for you, bye bye collective. Hello, brother. so much this next melee I, I wrote for um, the third album and um, I live Maui I'm originally from Panaeva homestead five acres I grew up on five acres you think I like mowing five acres picking up guava oh, oh. so now my other half and I we bought our market value hale and I don't have to do much yard, so I hire out now. Because, you know, when you do yard your whole life, man, it's so much work. But, you know, this song talks about the love I have for Maui. And Mauna Leo, I live on the slopes, the Ahupua'a of Moku, the Moku, and Ahupua'a of Wailuku in the Ili of Kalua on the hillside of Mauna Leo. And I wrote this song when um, I wrote for two grants and I got denied. So I wrote a song. <laughs> I was a little sad. I was like, what am I going to do? Um, you know, COVID in 2020, I got denied on two grants. So um, I'm going to write a song. And this song talks about my love for this place where our hale is built. Our hale is built on Kahikili compound. So you hear the word kahikili because that's where he could see the fleet come in. He could see other ali'i come in from the hono of Pi'ilani. And Mauna Leo is often called Mauna Leo or Mauna Leo according to Auntie Hoku. But we know it as Mauna Leo of Pu'ukukui. It's so beautiful. I get to see that every morning. And I wrote this song with the melody in my head in five minutes on my lanai while gazing at Mauna Leo from my room and my lanai looking at Haleakala as well. I said, oh, mahalo kea kua no no pomai kaya pao. And you hear the word lehua ika iu iu. I, I use that term as I come from the big island and my other half and my mama, we take care of my mama. My mom lives with us, so I take care of her. We talk about how this lehua blossom flourish as we are the lehua, the seeds, the ano ano of this lehua, placing myself in Maui um, and finding a new home. So ladies and gentlemen, can you give a round of applause for the beautiful vahine of Hula Halau o Kamuela on the direction of Kumuhula, Kaui Kamanao in Kunava Mok. Thank you ladies for dancing because I know you guys are getting ready for Merry Monarch and representing your ohana and your kopuna. But thank you so much for dancing. 
about a place that I love so, so much. Okananiya kapio keao kahului na hondo api ilani kaubua makalua kafaya kane hali hali na lewa itai okananiya. Thank you so much. Mahalo hula hala o kamuela. It's so beautiful. Thank you so much. I cannot wait to eat, eat squid luau after this. No more good squid luau. Too Maui. You know Maui is known for the kind of like healthy food, like down to earth. You know quinoa. I don't even know how to spell quinoa. No, I know how to spell. I just. Don't. On how any immersion, I know how to spell. Okay, so this next smell is for you. Look at your loved ones, say, I love you. Look at them and go, I love you. Go. Look at your loved one and go, we're going to save our money so we can see Kalani and his full piece band at the fifth annual May Day concert at Hawaii Theater. Look at it. You gotta. <laughs> <laughs> Some of you get comp tickets already. I love singing all kinds of music. So, at this moment, because I do this often in various crowds, if you guys can do me a biggest favor, which I don't have it with me. Alan, are you here? Alan? 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 Well, bring out your cameras. Put on the light real quick. Turn on the light and sway it left and right for me. Yes, yes, turn on, turn on your phone. If Elton John can do this in front of 80,000 people, I can do it in front of 50 people. Come on, yes. I love singing this kind of songs. Love songs. Sway it back, left, and right. Oh, yes. Give me your own chance. Oh, yes! Always 
stand forever Each moment with you Oh yes It's like a dream to me That somehow came true And I know tomorrow Will still be the same as Cause we've got a life of love That won't ever change And every You guys can sing with me Love me a special way Melt all my heart away Go oh, with your smile Oh my God, you like this Take time to tell me You really care And we'll share tomorrow Together Oh yes it is And I will I collected oh yes I feel no kawa mau hamales every day on melt all my pool vai away sing sing with your me no Thank you. Well, hello. In 2000, um, I was a senior in high school in Navahi, and I wanted to learn how to write Hawaiian music. And so I asked my kumu if I could be in Papa Hakumele, a Hawaiian language Hakumele course at UH Hilo 450. So I was with a bunch of 20, 21 year olds, know it all. <laughs> and so I was like the baby in the class, the biggest boy in the class. And I was like, oh, I'm so nervous. But Kumu Larry Kimura says, yes, please join the class. And he too wrote Kaukapea with this, the melody I sang for you. But I wrote this song, I wrote the lyrics 20 years ago to honor 
all mothers, but mostly my mama, who gave birth to this really big boy. She had a bad cesarean with me. I was a C-section child, and the, the nurses in Hilo Hospital dropped me, and I ended up like this. <laughs> just, 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 I just wanted to say that. They didn't drop me. I don't know what happened. I had a concussion. I don't know. But uh, I wrote this song to honor my mama because people think it's just a song about, you know, whether it's Kukia Imauna movement. No, I wrote this 20 years ago. And I couldn't come up with a melody until 2016. And so I cried when I sang it to my mama for the first time when I recorded this album, my first album um, here in Salt Lake with Dave Tutsarom. And I was able to perform at Mary Monarch for one of the Miss Aloha Hula contestants in 2019. And I want to dedicate this minute to all you mamas, all you grandmas, all you great grandmas who love, who love your children. Alyssa, oh, you dance this. Do bear, fula halau kamuela. Please give her a round of applause. And when I wrote this song, ladies and gentlemen, people asked, a mauna ia. I said, there's a kahako on the mauna. And the poetically, I told Kumu Larry Kimura, that means bruised or hurt. So my mom was going through some issues. But I wanted to dedicate this song for her, for her love for, for me and my siblings, and for her grandchildren. I love my mom so much. She wanted to be here tonight. But um, we were on a budget, so she's stuck on Maui. <laughs> but she'll be here at Hawaii Theater, if you guys can come to our Hawaii Theater show. Um, but I received a C on this song, and I was so pissed off. <laughs> I cried. I said, is it because I'm the baby in the class? Uncle Larry Kimura says, you need to come to class, Mr. Pe'apono e Papa. So I put it on the album. And when I won the first Grammy, I said, what is my grade now? And he goes, B minus. <laughs> Good morning to you. UFO. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, from Hula Halau Kamuela, please give it up, the beautiful Alyssa Dober. Mauna Kea. Mauna Kea Kila Kila Te Wakaui Lui e hu kamakua O kulani Poli a hu kawa ine Kawa hauanu Umehana kawa ine E apo mai E e e Mauna kea kila kila ke wakaui Luhi e hu kamakua o kulani Poli a hu kawaine kapa hauanu Umehana kawaine e apo mai e Oh, 
Thank you, honey. Thank you so much. Okay. You know, uh, this next melee was also composed by Uncle Peter Moon and Kumulari Kimura. And, um, and this song was written for Kula Kayapuni at first. So if you know this melee, sing along. And if you don't know the melee, then don't sing it. <laughs> you can try. Try. Oh, look at you. You guys look so beautiful. All right. Okay, clap your hands with me. Come on. Come on. Yes, Honolulu. Here we go. Makapina akala hi hai ha ae ae kamale olu ole Makana ole For you, Papa Kolea, here we go. O Coca Cola Ivia, Coca Cola Aina Aloha, Coca Cola Huikea, Coca Cola, Nicolella Havaya, Maua Mau, Macapina, Akala, Hiha. Come on, let's go. Transition. 
Ivy. Thank you. Again, give it up for Puka and all his coordinating and his hard work. Puka is saying thank you. I love you. Please give it up again for Kumuhula, Kaui Kamanao, and Anakala Kuneva Moka. Uncle Kuneva Moka, you're here. You want to dance a song? No. No, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> you want to dance Hanalei Kapili Moi? No. Okay, okay, no need, all right. Yes, you know what? They're like, it's kind of like, you know, well, when Mary Monarch's like two weeks away, and you know, they're getting ready. I'm so excited to go back to my hometown, Hilo, yeah? They eat Chinese food, Leong's, what else? <sighs> Maui, no more good Chinese restaurants. <laughs> yeah, no more, yeah? Oh, oh putting. Yes, it is you. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our beautiful Vahine of Hulahalau Okamuela. Please give a round of, round of applause. Please, please, please. And give a round of applause for all the entertainment tonight too, please. I got to spend time. I got to spend time. How oh, this head cold, I tell you. I got to spend time with Auntie Nani outside. And she sang this song with me. I co-composed this song with Kumuhula Devin Kamelo for us. For our love of your, your Mokopuni. This place called Maunavili. Oh, it's such a beautiful place. And I, when we wrote this mele, we, we talked about how two lover birds walk through Mauna Vili. Vili, entwine. Pili, two of us. Kili, the type of rain in that area of Nu'uwanu. I love Nu'uwanu too so much. But you know, Kumuhula Chikimahoi, I love Kailua, you know. Oh, I gotta get a hold of Keone Souza and go buy some house over there, probably. <laughs> Oha. Okay, so. <laughs> I love Oha. Oh. I'm ruining the moment. Okay, so. <sighs> this song is, is a duet with Auntie Nani and I, and I, and I just love your Aina so much too, so. We use a lot of kauna and, of course, our maivi when it comes to hakumele. And it talks about love. Oha, oha. Ohu, ohu. Ke ano o keia kili. Keia kili hau o kaua. Iho o pā i ka ili. A ahe mea liki ai. Ma vaho ke aloha. And the song goes something like this. Ikan na 
に思う。ああ、いけ、いかんなに思う。This is my last song because I gotta eat my、uh, kalua pig after this. <laughs> Thank you so much for having me. I love you guys so much. I love you, Puka. For my Kai Lyman, her daughter is gonna be singing. We're gonna be jamming at the.、Um, at the At my May Day concert, come, come. Kumu,、um, Kumu, Chinky Mahoya approved. He's one of the judges for our lay contest. We're giving away $500 worth of prizes from Manuhele'i, Nakeu, as well as, am I missing someone? Keho Shopping Center. So he's one of the judges. I know, and you're probably going, what? You said yes? Yes. I just asked him right before this. So come, Hawaii Theater. If you like, enter the late contest. You have to be present. And if you buy VIP tickets, you get free presents from me. I love gift giving. <laughs> you guys all look at me like, what? <laughs> so please come. We have Napua Greg and Hula Halau Nale Komaka Uka. We have Liam Moletta, beautiful falsetto singer. We have Uncle Sunny Ching, Atile Momi Ho. We're going to have,、um, it's my fifth annual May Day, so please come. Full band, please come. Hawaii Theater. Give it up for Vai Vai Collector. Thank you. This is my first time singing in this beautiful venue. So cute. So, we, you guys have to participate with me on this song. Shanti, I'm so happy to see you. You guys flew in from Hilo. You guys cruising throughout the weekend, getting some Chinese food, Korean food too. Yes. Golden Duck at MSG over there. Okay, anyway, so we, you guys are gonna sing with me, okay? If I go, this mele was composed by Uncle Ernest Kala of、um, Kalao Papa Molokai. To honor the people who were suffering from the Hansen's disease, it was an anthem song, a mele for the people of Molokai. So, you guys gotta sing with me. I know it's been a long day, but you're gonna sing with me. It's participation. This is an intimate concert, yeah? Kumuhula, overall award winning Kumuhula, Chinki Mahoy. Ladies and gentlemen, you guys are gonna sing. Yeah, give a round of applause. We have、D、Hula Royalty here. And the, and, the, and the granddaughter of Auntie Genoa Keave. Oh, she's gonna be at the May Day too. Can you give a round of applause on my guitarist right here? He just got back from New York City. He's prob you're probably jet lagging, yeah, my brother. Wailao Ryder, ladies and gentlemen. His Hello, daughter is Fehile. Up for the Hoku Awards this year. Yes, sir.、Uh, okay, so, yeah, give a round of applause. Wailao Ryder on guitar. It's just、Hello. you and I today, my brother. Okay, so this song, when I go, Ika Lave, you guys gonna go, Lave Alilo, ta 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 ta. Very easy. Yeah, easy. We get them, yeah, for mine. Ika Lave, Ika Pono. You guys, wow, you guys are pee. 
Oh, you guys never learned that part. Okay. So, pono, righteousness, authenticity, seeking balance. So, this was also uh, coming from the wise proverb of Kawi Keoli Uamau Keo Kaine Kapono. As he initiated that movement, he told our people in order to, to holomua, we must sequester. Such a big word, yeah. Kayapudi did a good job, I tell you. We must separate our people so we are safe. So your ohana must go kalau papa. So Kawi Keoli wanted to ensure that he malama our lahui, that our lahui thrive through that pandemic. So when I go ikalave, you say lave alilo, to become, to withheld, to assure, to make sure that we move forward. He is going to go lave alilo, okay? Ikalave, ikapono, pono amau. Pono amo. Ready, go. Okay, no, no, you don't have to tell. Follow me. Like song contest. Okay. E kapono. It gotta be louder than that, Vai Vai Collective. E kapono. There you go. Yeah. Uwa mo keo kai nai kapono. Tweaking on Starbucks, come on. All right. Uwa mau keo kainai kapono. It's a teachable moment, yeah, Kumupo Mai. This is very intimate. You guys are like, I never paid this much money to really do this in Kaladi Peon. I was here to relax, not sing. Okay. I love. Anything for you, Kumuhula Chiki Mahoy. All right, so this one's for you. This is my last song, Mahalo Nui. I love you all. Have a good night. And I love you. Oahu Lua. Oahu Kakui Heva. Here we go. Sorry, I only forgot the words. Okay, that's what you get when you starve your whole self. The whole, the whole day I starve myself, which I should be. But, you know. Okay, let's go from the beginning. One more time. <laughs> In, look, Alan, he goes like this. What is going on? I had coffee. I had Starbucks after, so I'm happy. Elikie oniapa. Enakinie oniapa. Enovihie oniapa. Enamokupunie oniapa. Enakinio kain. Enamama.
Lather yourself in purple and lavender for me. Yes, sir. Ina mukupuni o Hawaii nei e alamai. Ina mano kini alehu e alamai. Mai Hawaii o ke ave a kauai o mano kalani o ni pa amau o ni pa amau. Ina mukupuni o Hawaii nei e na mano kini alehu e alamai. Wake up, i kalave. No kapono e e na kini o kaina i kalave i kapono sing sing with me uwa mau uwa mau one more time uwa mau ke o kaina i kapo. Mahalo nui vai vai collector. Hanoho, my loves. And then I can eat kalua pig. I heard the squid luau is ono. Oh, I cannot wait to take my gout pills and then just eat the. I just joke. I no more gout. I just joking. I no more gout. I just. I know more God, I promise. No more God, no diabetes. I'm good. I'm just big. Okay, so. Well, that's what he said. But anyway. Uh, uh, anyway. This last million I wrote in 15 minutes. With my last, um, another 12-string guitarist to play with Kelly Irachel. For 30 years, he retired with him to play music with me. Nanko Ayao Kua passed away suddenly in 2021. Tragic, tragic. It was a moment of, for me to really reflect on the purpose on life. That through change, through this pandemic, we have to love each other no matter what. And Nanko Ayao wrote this mele with me. I wrote the lyrics and he wrote, co-wrote the lyrical movement and melody with me. We recorded the music video, you guys call it The Ruins, which is called Kania Kapupu. And I went there in 10th grade when I was in Napuno Eao, when I was 189,000 pounds lighter. And <laughs> with Auntie Hoku Holt and Kelly Irachel to this place, to Ho'okupu. And I wrote the words and couldn't come up with a melody until 2020 when I recorded this song to honor Kaui Keoli, his love for Kania Kapupu, the sound of the Kahuli. Auhea oi eke Kahuli, where art thou? Where are you, the shell? And so the song talks about how that area of Nu'uwanu and Manoa, he lehu lehu a mano mano, ka ike ena oia mau pupu, keia pupu olohaka. Keia kahuli, a puka maila keia kahuli, e imi i hale ho, e imi i hale ho. How in the world did I come up with that poetically? As the land snail leaves its shell to find a new home. And our kahuli is very endemic, but more so, some of them are extinct. So I talk about that metaphorically of how all of us had to pivot to change. We had to adapt to change in 2020. We are the kahuli. We had to leave one home and search anew. Some of us had to adapt to change. Huge. And to be effective through change through COVID-19. The chorus that I created... Iu iu oia hulu as our ali'i wear the hulu, hulu mamo, as we honor their legacy and the noble ones, Kalama and Kawikeoli, of such a vahipana of Nu'uanu and Manoa. This is for you, O Ahulua. 
This is for you. This is for you. May you go home safely knowing that through all the changes and all the effective changes that we go through in life, that there's a growth mindset and that we're continuing to learn and we're continuing to thrive as a Lahui. So with this last mele, one of my original songs for you, Oahu, how much I love you, Oahu Lua O Kakui Heva, Kaui Kahano. Please give it up for the wonderful award winning halau, Hula Halau O Kamuela. Have a good evening. Hula halau kamuela. Mahalo.